for me, there was uh, this character is uh, so complex. But throughout the movie, I was wondering how you were getting around the colors. Um, <laughs> did you find it very restrictive? It was restrictive. There are times where you feel like it's just sort of eating you, you know. Um, and you come away at the end of the day with weird injuries, like um, ear chafing, <laughs> uh, the starch colors. But actually, this is the experience of the of the people who lived in this time, and so it felt good to be living within their injuries and their um, the, the quirks of, of these crazy clothes that they had. One of the things I loved about your character was that he's one of the few people who's honest with her. Mm -hmm. But sometimes honesty can cross the line. Mm -hmm. So you, do you like being told you've got food in your teeth or <laughs> um, that your fly's undone or you know, something stupid? Or do you prefer just to go through the moment? It depends who's telling me or how <laughs> it's... Um, I would like to know that I have food in my teeth before I do a TV interview or right. something. But my, my wife is quite good at just being very... Um, in a, in a brilliant way, in a humbling way, she'll just tell me like, you know, ah, oh, that's gross, or do that, you know. Um, I won't tell you what she finds gross, but um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, I, no, I, 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 it's better. I'd, I'd rather know, yeah. yeah. Um, you're about to play uh, Bowie, mm -hmm. and you've said that one of the reasons you liked uh, uh, you took on the role was because it was a challenge. Mm -hmm. um, he was thinking of giving up and it was kind of rough for him at that time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I was wondering for you, have you ever gone through something where you've questioned whether you want to continue in music or acting or you felt very mm -hmm. challenged? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, I, I felt like um, as a young actor, things weren't working for me in the way that I wanted them to. And it's, I think it's very hard to, to be a young actor. You just are sort of, you're like thrown against the wall to see if you stick, you know, and uh, it can be quite, um, and you have the least confidence obviously as a young person and you have no kind of successes under your belt. You don't have anything to go on and you're just in these kind of humiliating uh, circumstances all the time and being rejected a lot. And, um, that's where music became very important to me because it was a way I could I could actually apply my creative expression without being questioned. Even if I wasn't putting the music out there, I was writing songs and that was very rewarding and I, I was playing in bands. And, and when we got offered our first uh, record deal, I'd just um, been on tour with a play for like a year uh, doing Shakespeare which was great, but as soon as that finished and I got this record deal, I wrote to my agent, I was like, right, I'm, I'm giving up now, I'm done, I'm done with acting because I've got this other thing. And thank God he persuaded me to, to stay you know, on the books and just to, he just was like, I'll just send you the odd script here and there. And, and it took a couple of years, but I came back to it and I, I, I was really missing it by that point. And then I was a bit older, a bit wiser, and I got the kind of jobs that I wanted to get. So it worked out. Well, we're very glad that it did. Thank you Thank so you. much. Thank you.